Hi, this is Piero, Head of Software Development at SecPoint. I would like to introduce some of the features of the new Protector 16.5. We can start with the Web Filter Report. The Daily Summary Report is the same report that is usually sent by email. Here you have a calendar where you can select the date of your report then you press OK and you get your data. The second report is the uh, summary report where you get the same data over a period of days. So you can select from and to dates with the calendar. Otherwise you can select one of these radio buttons then you press OK and you get your data over the selected period of days. Here we have the report from the 3rd of July to the 10th of July. Of course, you can select any period you like. Then we have the third report, which is the user usage summary, where you can enter the IP address of one of the machines in your local area network then you can select the period for instance here we want to know the summary of internet usage for this machine over the last 30 days and here we are and this is the result Another feature that has been introduced is in the email export function. This function is in the email menu. You can click on export emails and you will see a filter that allows you to choose which messages you want to export. Let's suppose we want to export all clean messages of today. So we click on search. The system says how many messages it has found to export so we can click on continue and then on save file and here we can see that the download begins immediately and this is the news that has been introduced with this new firmware in fact now emails are picked from the system compressed and downloaded immediately without the creation of a temporary file that could take a very long time. Here we are. We also made improvements to the system logs management. In this page, you can enter the number of days after which the protector will automatically clean the logs. Now, if you change one of these values, the protector will immediately check if that specific log has to be cleaned or not. Now, for instance, let's change the value for mail log from 15 to 5. We see that this log has been cleaned last time on the 2nd of July. And if we press OK, the log will be cleaned now. Of course, because mail log is one of those logs that do not get cleaned completely, the sides, the new sides of the log is not zero, but the log has been cleaned now. The last new feature we're going to talk about is the customization of the paging system. The paging system is used by the web filter log and by the spam message listing. If you go to the advanced menu and then you click on setup paging system, you can see that the default value is 50, but you can change it to any one of the available values in this list. For example, 200. And then, if you go, for example, to the web filter log, you will see that in any page, 
now we have 200 items displayed. If you want to have more details about the features described here and the detailed list of enhancement and bug fixes of Protector 16.5, you can read the release notes document that is issued with every new release of the Protector. It's all for now. Thank you for your attention and see you next time.